is the magic man once again i'm still on the court the light stayed on i thought they was gonna go off when i did the other video let me see if i can bust another video very quickly so federer he ain't tripping nadal fans tripping federer fans tripping other tennis fans tripping but federer ain't tripping i'm telling you Tennis preacher, prophet, psychic, coming back at you again with another video. People, if you read that title I put, I didn't put it's Federal versus Chung. But it's federal versus Chungism. Now, what, now I've, I've defined Chungism as this is a momentum, people. And so federal got to be careful. Now, I've already made a conventional preview, and I still stand by that. That I think federal can beat Chung from a conventional standpoint. And I gave conventional reasons. But people, this is a totally spiritual video, people. Call it momentum. Fe this is going to be interesting, people. I'm going to be honest about it. I think it's 50-50. And people say, wait a minute, what you mean 50-50? 50-50 with Federer versus Chung? Yeah, I'm talking about, see people, it's more, Federer ain't just playing Chung. Federer is playing a momentum that's around Chung. Federer is playing the crowd that's going to be behind Chung. Um, Federer is going to be, man, he's going to be playing tennis angels that's behind Chung. Federer gonna be playing those tennis spirits and tennis ghosts that's behind Chung. Man, listen, people. I'm gonna say something here. Federer better not come in there with some arrogance, like thinking he got this in the bag. And let's say he lose the first set, people. I'm gonna be honest about it. I think if Federer lost the first set, I think he'll lose this match. Now, this is amazing. I think Federer needs to win the first set so he can just kill this Chungism. I'm telling you, you would think that I, you would think that Chung should win the first set, but it's actually Federer should win the first set. So, so people, this is um, Federer, Federer got to be careful, man. So this gonna we're gonna find out. Federer got the really listen, man. It would be easier to beat Nadal. Federer, it would be easier to play Nadal. Federer has played Nadal many times. He knows what to expect from Nadal. He knows he can beat Nadal on the hard court. Federer knows the uh, how the crowd reacts to Nadal or when he plays Nadal. Federer has never played against this type of chung. Chungism thing I'm talking about. Well, I mean, he may have some experience where the crowd was behind and somebody had some momentum, but listen, Federer, this is a special situation, and it's going to be interesting how Federer handles this. Federer going to have to play this. He's going to have to play this like he's playing. He's going to have to actually play Chung like as if he's playing the Djokovic at his best. Because, see, it's going to be, see, Chong, see, man, listen, Chong is bringing a lot of elements with this thing. More than just some, man, this is more than just some young kid playing. There, like I said, there's a whole energy behind him. Federer is playing the momentum. He's playing an energy. And this energy is getting stronger. So, like I said, Federer better make sure he win that first set. But like I said before, it'll be interesting just to see how Federer handles this Chong's. Uh, situation okay and uh, I think he's great enough to handle the thing if he don't get arrogant with this here like thinking no oh, man okay uh, if he played Chong as if he's just Chong then Federer could lose this and I mean lose it but if he played Chong as if this is Chongism the way the tennis prophet is saying like this guy has an energy and a momentum this is something really serious I better deal with this very carefully okay people and I better take it seriously okay people magic man tennis preacher psych is signing off have a good one Magic man, tennis pastor, preacher, psychic, y'all know the way we do it.